Hey y'all, welcome to a Wet Your Whistle Wednesday on Uncle Bud's Bale Buckle Bear Reviews. Alright y'all, so today I've got a brew out of Asheville, North Carolina from the Green Man Brewery. I've had a couple of their brews before, but I, I have a hard time getting them around here. Um, but today's brew is a Wayfair IPA. It's a 6% alcohol by volume. Um, it doesn't really give any kind of indication about what what it's brewed with or anything like that um but anyway i've had a couple of green man's brews and, and i've enjoyed them so i saw this one uh, and i said i gotta try it so we're gonna give this green man ipa wayfarer a try today on a wet your whistle wednesday Let's see what we got here. Ooh, man, that's pale. Wow. That is a very pale ale. Look at that beautiful gold color. Wow, I'm not getting any kind of aroma off of it at all. Mm -mm, oh my goodness. <laughs> Mmm. Oh my goodness, y'all. All right, so I am very surprised. I am not getting any kind of aroma off this head at all. And you can see I poured it hard. I've got a nice head on it. But man, it's not got any kind of aroma. But when you taste that head, man, I'm telling you what, it's got the it's got the delicious, delicious hop character in that head. Mmm. Mmm. And it's a, it's a kind of a cross. The flavor, let me give it a good swish here. It, the flavor is kind of a cross between a pine and an earthy type flavor. I'm, I'm catching notes of the earthy type and, and notes of the pine as well. Neither one of them are kind of overpowering each other. It's kind of strange. I've never had anything like that. Um, but it is a beautiful gold brew. And that hop character and that flavor, that flavor in that head is, uh, is delicious. It's got, a, it's got a nice sharp bitterness in the finish of the head. Mmm. But just slight notes of pine, slight notes of that earthy type flavor, and and a nice bitter finish. Pretty brew. Now it was a little more. <laughs> I, I swished the can before I poured the rest of it in there, and that clouded it up quite a bit. But that is a beautiful gold brew. I don't know if y'all can see it. Put it up against the wall there. You can see how how the beautiful color of that thing is. Man, that's pretty. And and. <laughs> I don't know y'all how it works, but me looking at it with a light glaring through it, it looks a lot more yellow than it does on the camera there. It looks a little bit darker on the camera, but it's, man, it's a beautiful gold color. All right, so this uh, Green Man Wayfarer American IPA from uh, out of uh, Asheville, North Carolina at a 6% ABV is for all American workers. Hey, I love and appreciate y'all. Sure do thank you for all the hard work that you do um, day in and day out to provide for yourselves and your families. What, making a living is hard, man. In times right now, everything's expensive. Gas is expensive. Food's expensive. You know, rent goes up and interest rates and all kinds of stuff, man. It's just tough to make a living. And if you work for a living, I don't care what your job is or how much you're paid, thank you for what you do. To pay your own way and pull your own weight. I love and appreciate y'all. Cheers, brothers and sisters. That is good, man. Now the uh, the the piney and earthy type flavor I was getting out of the head. Uh, those hop flavors. I'm not really detecting it in the body. What I'm getting in the body is kind of strange. Oh, 
but it's it's like a mild citrusy note is what I'm getting out of the body of this thing and it's delicious it's very easy to drink very smooth um, it's got good carbonation and and I'm not getting the pine I'm not getting the earthy I'm getting a mild just a very mild citrus or juicy type flavor in the body of this thing very good very smooth man mm. very tasty brew um i'm going to score this one an a minus uh because it, it it's good it's not the greatest i've ever drank but it is a good american ipa it's good a minus i think is a fair score for this one got nice lacing beautiful color a little bit hazy so anyway y'all hey that's been a wet your whistle wednesday this week um i'll be back tomorrow for a Tennessee Thirsty Thursday. I've got another Tennessee brew I'm going to do for you tomorrow. Um, so y'all stay tuned for that. I love and appreciate y'all. If y'all like the videos, there's a little beer mug right there. You subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'm not monetized, but I just love drinking beer, loving on people, and making videos. So I'll be back tomorrow. Y'all stay tuned. Take care. And cheers. <laughs>